Okay, so today I'm gonna try to make uh, yellow loving. I have all purpose flour, I just put one cup, and we're gonna add some cold water and just make a firm sort of dough. Bring this together. Need, need, need. Okay, once you need, we're gonna set it aside for like 10 minutes, not more than that. Okay, it's been more than 10 minutes, I would say. No matter what texture the dough is, we're gonna be adding water and we're gonna get the um, gluten, I guess, out of it. So let's add this much to begin with. And we're just gonna squeeze. Ooh. And try to get all the gluten out. Only leave only the gluten. Once the water sort of turns like very milky, we're gonna pour it in a different container. Okay. Okay, this has been sitting um, for a while. Uh, I would say like an hour and a half or two. We just have to make sure that the water that's floating on top, we can get rid of it. So you can either do it this way or you can scoop it up using a spoon or a ladle to do that. Well, let's do the ladle. Try to scoop as much as you can out without taking any of the gluten that's sitting down there. As you can see, we got most of the water out. The only thing that's left is this really thick milky. Try to, oh, oh my god. Okay, try to stir carefully. And then we're gonna add a little bit of turmeric to make that yellow loving color. And we're gonna stir it.
Okay, now we have the remaining uh, flour that I have sitting here. I'm gonna add a little bit of baking powder. Oh, that's too much. Okay, maybe like half a teaspoon or something. And we're just gonna scrunch this together. And we're gonna steam this for about 10 to 12 minutes or even 15. This is what the shazuma is gonna be, so. Okay, I have my moksang heating up. Um, you can use any kind of metal plate or even aluminum foil or however you want. I have this cake tin. I have two of them. So I thought this is like the perfect size and I can just lay it down and then it can cook. You can also let it sit on top of the water and let it float. It's all up to you. Anyways, we're gonna add some oil. I'm going to spray some, spray your oil and then put it on the thing and then we're going to do one ladle I think depending on how thick or thin, sometimes thin is better to be honest and just let it cover on all sides and then we can go ahead and steam that you can steam for about three to four minutes, not more than that, and then it becomes really hard. So we'll just set, try with this for now. Okay, and as you can see, water's boiling. We can add our, um, like that, yeah, and then close it, cook for two minutes, or we can use the other one too. I put one on the water and one I'm going to put with the steamer in. We're going to cook for maybe three minutes. We should be done. So... I may have put the turmeric a little too much, but once you take it out, look how soft it is. Okay, let's take it out of that thing. We're gonna move it, we're gonna transfer it to another plate. I just took it out. And we're gonna transfer it to this plate. And it looks orange, oh my god. But anyways, I'm gonna add some more oil here too, so it doesn't stick. this here we're gonna take the other one out because it's cooking pretty fast so I don't think it needs to stay there for a very long time I'm gonna go ahead mm, it's hot oops all right that's fine go to cook in two minutes and then this one Okay, I finally made some yellow lapping. I don't think I'll make it ever again because it was too much of work and only this much lapping. So, I'm gonna make a dry one. And this one is a little thick on one side and a little love love on the other side. Anyways, what we're gonna do, we're gonna add some chili oil. 
I'm gonna add a little bit of garlic. I'm gonna add a little bit of vijing and then a pinch of salt and then we're gonna spread it some people like to add vinegar some people like to add soy sauce I'm gonna just leave it simple honey shows them the key you can put it right in between and then we're gonna fold it and hopefully I, oh my gosh I should do it the other way around so, all right let's fold and roll it roll it roll it Ta-da! some people like to put vai vai also but I think I'll just eat it just the way it is. And this is my plate. I'm gonna put it on here. Oops. Let's take one. That's a pretty thick one. Mmm. Spicy. Okay, I'm gonna make the the soup one. Some people like to eat the soup one. So what we're gonna do for the soup is we're just gonna fold and then slice into like this. Put it here. We're gonna add a little bit of this shazuma and then a little bit of the garlic. A little bit of the chili oil. And a pinch of salt. And then a little bit of bleaching. Totally optional. And then I'm gonna put a little bit of the light soy sauce. And there you have it. Loving seal.